Hello everybody, it is Hogan Rules, and today I'm going to do my WWE Thursday Night Smackdown reaction. The reason why I did not do it on the 10th, I just watched it, and the 11th I was tired from school, and now the 12th, it's the weekend, Saturday, so I'm going to do it, and here we go. What first happened was Seth Rollins was talking, come out, talking about stuff, I think he did, not necessarily in college if I'm wrong or not. Um, he came out just talking about how he's going to win and stuff, and he wants this rematch with Ryback and for, for a long jack in the main event, which is pretty cool. What I thought about that was I knew Ryback was going to win, but a Lumberjack match, I knew something was going to be up. Um, the Ascension versus Lucha Dragons. Now, the Ascensions align themselves with Stardust, and they call themselves Welcome to the Cosmic Wasteland. Well, he um, portrayed Bad News Barrett, King Barrett, um, Way Barrett, whatever you call him. He portrayed him, and he might he's going to portray the Ascension if they fail him. I know he is. And he's going to get, and he's going to get that. After that, he's going to get like stabbed in the back or something. Stardust is going to get beat up from how many parties he's going to have in the future. I don't know what. But the Ascension did defeat Lucha Dragon thanks to Stardust getting in the way. The Ascension did the Fallen Man and won a match. They finally won a match after, like, what, a long time? They just lost on Monday. They won a match on Thursday. Oh, my God. <laughs> on Thursday, I'm sorry about that. Um, Roman Reigns, Dean Ambrose, and Dean Ambrose versus The New Day. This is not in order, by the way. Versus The New Day. It ended up in no contest because Jimmy Uso was about to do a splat off the top rope. And then the lights go dark, and then you hear, see, hear and then like that, and then, and then you look, and there's Jimmy Uso getting choked out by Braun Strowman, the new guy that's replacing Eric Rowan, because Eric Rowan quit or something, or whatever happened. Uh, and then they, then the, then Dean Arrows and Roman Reigns go up there, and then they disappear, and, they, and then you hear Bray Wyatt's voice, they all fall down. <laughs> I think it's just trying to do some controversy where it's but like um it's supposed to make you more excited for the match and it's making me really excited for this match coming up on Night of Champions, which I'll be doing my predictions video Thursday, Friday or Saturday, or Sunday before it comes on. Um I will be watching it though, with my with my um uh, best friend uh, hey, subscribe to his channel. Um now what next happened with well, this is not a word by the way. Seamus did Seamus taunted Seth Rollins that he might have a third match, which he's been doing over the weeks, and he might have a third match if he um, uh, gets through both of them or doesn't. He might, well, yeah, if he gets through both of them, he's gonna probably maybe have a third match and he might cash in or something, or Seamus cash in the middle of Sting and Seth Rollins match and then pin the challenger. That might happen. I don't know. Who's blow? What do you think is gonna happen on that day, uh, on that night, night champions? Um, Paige versus Sasha Banks ended in a no contest because of, because of, um, uh, because they just got really mad and they started beating up each other and then all the rest of them got involved and the brawl just kept going and going and going and eventually stopped and no one won that match. Now, so, now, um, uh, what I thought of the match was, um, it's a spiral in the Divas Revolution, but I keep saying is that they should add some more Divas because I'm starting to get bored with it a little bit after like two months of seeing the same thing. Yeah. Rams slided from Charlotte versus Nikki Bella. Pretty sure Nikki Bella's going to win. I'm not so sure. Um, Cesaro versus The Miz. Uh, what I thought of that match was an epic match between Cesaro and The Miz. It did not end in double count, which it did on Monday. Also, that. Charlotte versus Nikki Bell will happen on Monday Night Raw. Not a champion that changed. Um, Cesaro defeated the Miz by making him submit to the uh, what, Brett Man hit move, but I forget what it's called. Um, I'll remember in a minute. But he defeated him in that in a submission. Miz tapped out to the Sharpshooter. Sharpshooter, that's what it's called. I thought it was a pretty epic match between Cesaro and the Miz. No big show coming out, ruining the match and stuff. Yeah. The Wyatt family warned anyone that who would team with Dean Ambrose Roman Reigns at Night of Champions that they would pay the price, and which they did. Randy Orton paid the price, Jimmy Uso paid the price. Who's going to be next? They're warning anyone to run. 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 <laughs> uh, so that's really exciting, but I hope I get to see a new 
shield or something happen or someone comes out or something happens or the old shield comes back, something like that. I don't know what's going to happen. New guy comes out or Eric Rowan returns and becomes a partner right there. I don't know what's going to happen, but I can't wait to see what happens on the champions. Um, Seth Rollins versus Ryback, the main event in a lumberjack match. And Seth Rollins won because everybody was brawling, like the lumberjacks were brawling. And Ryback had him up in the cell shock, and Kevin Owens tripped Ryback. And Ryback lost to Seth Rollins' pedigree him. And Kevin Owens was like all smirking and smiling and everything. And uh, Kevin Owens has a deal with Ryback because he wants the Intercontinental Championship, and that match will happen on Night Champions. Um, before all, before that match ended, it was the, the they took out the Big Show. Big Show like um got escorted from the other lumberjack. Neville flew outside the ring, took out everybody. Uh, everyone was just in a brawl in this match, and this was a pretty cool epic match. I like these kind of matches. It's it's awesome when he, like um did you see Adam Rose dressed up as some other time? You can see other people go out there that don't even wrestle much. They're out in the lumberjack match, which is um I don't know. Trying to give him TV time, I don't know. Uh, uh, so, I thought of this. This is like, they beat each other one and one. So, they're probably going to have a match on Monday. And I, what I thought of this match was pretty epic. And please like this video, leave a comment, and subscribe for more Hobo Rules out. Bye, guys.